Hi guys, in this episode of Ray the K, I'm gonna be reacting to a comeback by the boy group Gravity that I somehow didn't realize was a thing. Usually, I think I'm overall pretty good at keeping up with the releases of different groups and everything, and even if it takes me a while, I still manage to react to all of their title tracks and stuff. But somehow, sometimes, some groups manage to like see through my fingers and I manage to miss them. This seems to be one of those cases. Although I think the reason why I've uh, not realized that this was released is because it's like a non-album promotional single. So it probably wasn't like a proper comeback, but they just released a song and a music video. I don't know. I really don't know. But I'm hoping that I'm going to like this song. Uh, even though Gravity are, are not like my most favorite boy group or anything, their music is pretty good. And I do enjoy what it is and how it sounds like. It's just that I'm still more of a casual fan of them rather than a a, a stan but still there's only one way to find out whether i'm gonna enjoy this song so without further ado let's get into gravity's vivid in three two one oh okay that explains why i missed it because it's a universe music video i don't really keep up with those i'm honestly not a big fan of those For whatever reason, Universe songs by any group are just not as good as their proper releases. Although this one does sound pretty good so far. Yeah, this definitely feels like gravity. Usually these universe songs also have the vibe of completely misunderstanding uh, what the music, uh, the group's music sounds like normally. But I feel like this is pretty in line for gravity. Hmm. They remind me a little bit of Stray Kids right here. That structure there with the rappers uh, one after the other, the vibe was very much like Stray Kids. Even the song itself sounded like Stray Kids, even though it doesn't for most of it. Honestly, this is not bad at all. Yeah, it's not quite up there as uh, the song My Turn, for example, but I definitely like this one. And I think it's very likely that I'm gonna listen to this one outside of the reactions, too. Okay. We're definitely going to be listening to this one a second time. Okay. Honestly, 
Uh, unlike the usual universe music video and song, I feel like this song is genuinely like pretty good at uh, describing exactly the kind of music and group that gravity uh, that gravity is. Because like I said before, I've listened to some other universe music videos, like I've listened to a universe music video for 80s, I think I've listened to one for The Voice or something, and those just weren't as interesting as those groups' normal releases. But in the case of this one, I think this very well, epitomizes uh, Gravity very well. They're um, more of a cutesy, like young, younger, youth-focused uh, boy group, and that's why I like their music. It's kind of refreshing compare, uh, when you compare them to most of the boy groups doing uh, either completely wild concept changes, comeback to comeback, or the hard-hitting, uh, uh, darker and edgier and rap heavier uh, boy group stuff. They do kind of stand out. They are very reminiscent of the boys in that regard, but they still have kind of their own vibe as well. And yeah, I enjoy this a lot. Again, it's not quite as replayable or as uh, much of a, a banger as I would like it to be, but it's definitely a casual bob that I wouldn't mind listening to again. And that's what we're gonna do before I say my final thoughts. So without further ado, let's get into Kravity's Vivid once again in 3, 2, 1. I love that part. I love that vivid part. So good. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna be listening to this one a lot. At least a decent amount. Again, because I lean more towards the darker and nature stuff, but whenever a cutesier and happier song like this is this good, I still have to listen to it, you know? I still have to listen to it outside of the reactions a lot. Man, even their voices remind me of Stray Kids members. Oh, I think this honestly might be climbing up to be one of my favorite Gravity songs. really fucking climbing up on that list of my favorite songs. I really am enjoying this one a lot. Oh 
Okay. I, I'm honestly, once again, like today I've reacted to already, this is like the third song that I'm reacting to today, and all three songs are surprisingly enjoyable to me. Um, they're not at all quite like the same vibe, but all of these songs I'm surprisingly in love with. Like, I don't know what it is. I don't know why sometimes I'm more lenient and more into like different sounding songs from the stuff that I love the most. But I am always so uh, entertained whenever it is the case. Because like, I, it's not like I want to hate any of these songs that I react to, but for whatever reasons, it's outside of my control when I actually enjoy some more variety in, in the songs that I react to like this. Because like, today this is like, like I said, the third song that I'm reacting to and I love it. And it's so different from what I want from the group and yet I still love it. But yeah, it's cutesy, it's... Well, it's not quite cutesy, I, I feel like that's maybe putting it too harsh, but it's definitely a softer uh, boy group kind of song. And like I said, not necessarily my favorite thing, but I do really enjoy this song quite a lot. And it is really catchy. I cannot deny that. It is really, really catchy. Yeah, um, in terms of rating for this one, I'm honestly going to go with a 9.2 out of 10. In many ways, it might as well be a 10 out of 10, if you ask me, because I feel like for the concept that they are going for with this song, I think there's not really much room for growth uh, in terms of the song being potentially better. I think it's as good as it could have been. Maybe it would have been better if it was slightly more bombastic, but I'm perfectly satisfied with what it is. And because this kind of song I feel like is never going to blow my mind as much as a more hard-hitting or more emotional song, 9.2 out of 10 is just the max for it. Like, it's basically, it's equivalent of a 10 out of 10. But yeah, I really like it a lot. I honestly should probably check out some Gravity B-sides at some point. I think I reacted to them, uh, to their B-sides once, back when they first debuted, but I'm not 100% sure because it's been like three years at this point. So, yeah, check out around the channel if I've uh, reacted to some of their B-sides, or potentially if you want me to check out some more B-sides from them, uh, comment that down below and let me know there is, that there is a demand for a reaction like that, or go through my Patreon and Coffee account where there is a specific tire which allows you to demand me to do a reaction to whatever it, group or album or music video uh, you want me to. But yeah, that's up to you. Anyway, what did you guys think about this song? Comment those down below and let's have a discussion about this. And also, before we end this video, I just want to give a huge shout out to my currently four patrons on Patreon. Omar Bridgman, Deadpool, Corvi Dead, and Theo Rose Gelatly. Thank you guys for your support, I really appreciate it, it really means a lot to me. You have decided to support me, you have continued to support me for such a long time. Hope you continue to enjoy my content and continue to support me going forward. Thank you very much. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, Please leave a like and subscribe. Also, check out the link in the description to my Wattpad where I post my stories. Because, in addition to doing all these videos on my channel, I'm also a writer. And if you don't enjoy my stories or simply enjoy my videos, you can head over to my Patreon or to my Coffee account where you can pledge support and help get the channel going. Help support me so I can keep writing stories you enjoy. But if you don't want to do it, that's completely fine. You can still help me out in other ways like liking this video, subscribing to the channel, and especially sharing this video with someone who you think might enjoy it. And I think it's pretty much it for this video, so hopefully I'm going to see you in the next one. Bye!